Chief Justice of India, after after listening from both sides, has now suggested or given the order that Rajiv Kumar should make himself available for uh, you know for discussion or uh, examining. But then no arrest is imminent. Uh, how do you see this, ma'am? Even though arrest is not imminent, but then the very fact that he has to be available, uh, does it does it show a, a budge from the rigidity that you all? Are I think about? it's a it's a moral victory. Why it's a victory? We said we have a great respect for the judiciary and the media and the, all the institution. Number one, this same, this order was passed earlier also that they can talk mutually in a mutual place. They can cooperate each other. Same today also the same thing, same verdict. We are grateful to that. Number two, yes, Rajiv Kumar never said that I will not be available. He said, let us, he has given five letters. He said, we want to meet a mutual place. If you want to ask any clarification, you can come, we can sit there. But what they, what they have started doing, they wanted to arrest him. They went to his house with secret operation, Sunday, without any notice. That court said, no coercion effect, no arrest. We are so grateful. We are so obliged because it will strengthen the moral of the office. Lacks of small investors were cheated and looted of their money. Is it not our moral obligation for their investigation? Why is Mamtaji silent on this? Why is other why are the other political parties silent on this? And this order was given by the Supreme Court to investigate the conspiracy angle and also money laundering angle, whether high people were involved or not, and regulatory failures. Today, this investigation must be done in a fair manner. Let us not politicize it. Today is a great moral victory of the CBI. Today, the Supreme Court has been told that the police commissioner will appear.